Hello and welcome to Ginger Man. Now, just a couple of weeks ago, I was in Milnathor, just along the road from where I stand right now. When I was there, it got me thinking about a music festival that used to go on near Milnathor called Tea in the Park. I used to go, I went a few times, I camped from around 2006 to 2010. So now I've come back, I've come to the Kinross services, just where I used to get dropped off with all my gear for camping at Tea in the Park. And now I'm here ready to see what's happening, what's changed, and I just have a day exploring round Balado. So Balado, show me what you got. Peace. <laughs> Here we go. Right, I'm on the road. We're officially on the road to Teen the Park. Few differences though. Teen the Park used to be in July. It's now December, so I'm more wrapped up than I would have been for going to Teen the Park. Uh, and I don't have a tent strapped to me and a crate of beer and all the things you would take to a music festival. Now, if you ever watched the Crystal Maze, uh, you'll know about the big crystal ball at the end. Well, that is one of the defining features of how to find where Teen the Park was. I wonder how long these skiddy breaks have been here. I swear, this is a way longer walk than I remember. Wow. I guess it was 14 years ago, 13 years ago, I was last here. There's loads of flying going on. Right, I'm taking a right along this road because this is where you would come along to find the entrance. When the week had in the park, right, this whole road would be jammed with cars and this whole pathway I'm walking this road along here just filled with festival goers in their backpacks. Times have changed. Talking of things being different, I accidentally shaved my beard the other day and by accident, I mean, I kind of meant it because I broke my toe um, but I made a deal with a fairy that every time I broke a bone, if I shaved my beard, it would heal quicker so I had to shave my beard kind of an accident, it was an accident I broke my toe I don't know, where's a safe place to walk here there's no pedestrian path got these woods next to me though these look fun Oh look Tenants, tea in the park, something's never changed How long's that tin been there for? It looks quite fresh actually Maybe some people come back every year and sort of just camp here Just to remember the good days There's another tenants tin, that's two I'll maybe keep a tenants tin counter Three, boom There's another tenants here Maybe that's why they cancelled the festival, too much aluminium litter. Four, that's four tins of tenants. Five, that's a crushed one. I'm just putting out their crushed tins still counting the same, but I've seen five.
you know, as well, when I was younger, when I came here, I didn't actually think about where I was. Like, there's Benarty Hill, just at the back. West Lomond over there. So, I just wasn't conscious of the, my surroundings as much as I am now, as an older gentleman. Um, but yeah, the farm goes right along. And right next to the music festival, so I wonder if the animals themselves miss miss the excitement of the music festival or they're enjoying the peace now. There's the crystal dome. Doesn't he smell nice in here? I want to get past this bit quickly. <laughs> it's a smell that I can't quite put my finger on, but it's a, not a nice smell. So I don't want to put my finger on this smell. Bonker. What's this? Malado Central. I don't know what it means, but... See, this is all this field area and further beyond that tree line and see that hill over there, right? That's where all the tents were and on that hill there was like an outside cinema at the bottom of it. There's sheep on it now. That's where I want to get to. I want to get to up there. Imagine finding some, I don't know, buried tea in the park memorabilia. That'd be amazing. I want to say this bit here, or over around this area, was where the main stage was, the main arena. See, I feel like this was one of the paths you'd have walked down to the main entrance, I guess. I know there's an airfield here now. Private property. Keep out. I don't know, how much can I exercise my freedom to roam here? I don't know, I want to get some... I just want to get close to where it used to be. Stand. Stand where the stage was, all these exciting things. Like, this is Balado Bridge, it says. It's incredible how wintry everything looks now. Summer feels like it was just yesterday. Look at this random rock. What is this? See, it looked like it had something on it. It's gone. What's the rock? Does anyone know what this rock is? Oh, yeah. I'm just thinking, there's a lot of rubbish dumped here. What is this? Is that a computer? <laughs> Let's have it. Oh yeah, boy. There's an entire computer being dumped at Balado. What is this hiding? That's Jeffrey Epstein's hard drive on that. It's chucked at Balado. Mad. Right, aye. So, where was I going with this? There's a lot of rubbish at the sides here. So I wonder how much of it is left over from the years between the park. Because let me tell you, there was a lot of rubbish and it was of a time when people cared less about the environment than they do today anyway, so aye, it was chaos. Chaos with rubbish. I'm gonna find some memorabilia here. I can feel it. There's another gate. I wonder where this was. I feel like this is where all the parking was and the main stage is now where all the airfield stuff is. That was pretty cool, a plane just went overhead. Um, I wasn't expecting to see that. Just so close to my head. That was pretty cool, I wonder if we'll get to go walk around and see some taking off. 
I better be uh, keeping my drone in the bag right now, away from this area. But I think over that side, where I first came from, I can get the drone up. So, we'll do that later on. Amazing. Just think of all the legends who have come through here. I've seen The Who at Tea in the Park, I've seen Oasis, I've seen Muse, the list goes on. And they all came to this very part of Scotland to perform. Amazing. <laughs> Talking of legends, your names are coming up the screen right now. My legends, my patron legends, because you're bigger legends than the legends that were here. Because you support the ginger man and allow me to keep traveling, allow me to have a better toe, allow me to have a better Christmas, and I, I've got some more footage coming out for the legends. If you want to join it, patron links below. Thanks. Peace. I think this is the main HQ of the farm that's here. Oh, aye. That's cool. A deserted building. Nice. Okay, another wee hidden gem. Right next to the, the main HQ of the farm. As I said, I'm not expecting to find too much around here. I don't even know where Bellado begins. Like, am I still in Bellado? I feel like this is definitely all Bellado. All of this. Some autumn colour, the last of it. So there's a plane taking off. Hey, mate. Mate, fancy taking my GoPro up with you? Mate. Don't know if you can hear me. Here's the thing, I thought that was just a pretend airfield. Like, uh, up until today, I've never seen planes taken off from here. Um, but aye, turns out it's, a, it's an active airfield. I'm walking along next to this road and it's quite ominously scary as cars are zooming past. Planes are flying over. I'm in the danger zone here. And if there is any band that is going to bring the sun out, it's got to be this lot. Two lads from Ochter Mochti. Craig and Charlie. I hope you're on fine voice because there's going to be plenty to sing along to. Please welcome to Tea in the Park, the Proclaimers! Here we go, this is the west gate of the, the airfield. Now, this is definitely, the airfield is exactly where all the stages were, right around here. This is where all the memorabilia is hidden. But because of the 2016 act, I can't, I can't get in there. I get, I get a naughty fine. So I'm just going to have to skirt around it all. Mate, you forgot the GoPro! The GoPro, mate, the GoPro. So I've asked ChatGPT, I said, why and when did the Scottish Music Festival Tea in the Park end? Do you know what it said? It said, Tea in the Park ended in 2016. The organizers announced that the festival would go on a hiatus in 2017 due to logistical and financial challenges, but it has not resumed since then. Well, well, well. I think I said 2016, I guess 2016, or did I say 2015? No, that's another question. Anyway, it doesn't matter. Financial difficulties. I wonder, is it costing too much to get the superstar celebrities in?
What a brave guy. What a brave, brave man. Or woman. Now what I'm thinking is, I can't cross over this way, so how do I get back to where I started? Because it's very apparent that I'm not getting into the field. I'm just getting to watch planes taking off and landing. See here? I bet there was a big stage somewhere right here. Spam litter. It's the last thing you expect to see littered. Empty tub of spam. More tenants. This is that bit of field where the tents were up there. See that? That's no wind. No wind. Perfect for a drone. Perfect for a drone. Look at this big bad boy bird. Look at him. He's huge. Hello, pal. We love things with wings. <laughs> I feel like maybe this is just an airfield where you come and have fun. You know, you just come up for a day, have a laugh, fly around, see, see the, the world from the sky. It's not like a serious airport or airfield. Well, it's serious enough that I can't just go wandering in, but it's fine. I'm thinking as I walk around here, right, pre tea in the park, right, pre modern world what else happened on this bit of land who all marched along this land was there battles here more than just a festival eh? think of all the things there could have been ancient festivals pagan ancient festivals going on in this field who knows it's just this all just feels like an area that's quite magnificent i think without all the live music nature around you puts on a big enough performance, but I'd love to see a music festival somewhere around here again. Because the idea of all the people coming together through music is a wonderful thing. And the sheep don't mind, I swear. Tenants, I've made it to another intersection, so I'm going to go back up this way towards what that sign says is Ken Ross, and then I'll have done the Balado loop. Um, unsuccessful in the merch find the Tina Park historic merch just lying around, not happening. Airfield instead, planes and sheep and farms. So, I've asked ChatGPT more information on Tea in the Park, and here's what it says. It was an annual music festival held in Scotland, known for its diverse lineup. First festival held in 1994, however, it took place at several locations over the years. Uh, I think it started in Glasgow, then came to Balado, then finished off at Strathallan Castle, that's what I know. Um, featured multiple stages. It's talking about people who played, but you could be there all day putting a list up of who played. And then in its final years, had problems with traffic, security and environmental concerns. So yeah, oh, I just fell in a puddle there. Kind of what I mentioned to, like, the, the environment wasn't on everyone's mind as much back in the, the early 2000s. And as it became more in the consciousness of people's minds, I think that's when we said, I don't know, how environmentally friendly these festivals are for the for the local area. I think that's a huge part of it. But here's a wee pal come and speak to me and tell me more. Hey buddy. What's your thoughts? 
on Tina Park. I feel like he wants to eat me. What is this animal? Is that a sheep? It doesn't look like a sheep. It's a big sheep. I'll give you some of this. Don't eat me though, pal. You got big teeth, yeah? Yeah, man. Don't pet it. I don't know what this is. What animal is this? Is that a sheep? It's a strange looking sheep. It's a big sheep. It looks like a donkey sheep. It's a donkey sheep. Hey, donkey sheep. He's like, don't call me donkey, boy. I ain't no donkey sheep. Hello. I really want to pet him, but I feel like he's, he's saying, mate, if you come in here, I am going to ram you. Ram you hard. He's got big balls, like, wow. He has got big balls. He's away. I think my favourite team in the park was the last one I went to in 2010. That film for me was the crescendo, the peak of my Tea in the Park experiences with Eminem, Kasabian and Muse headlining. The lineup was insane. I think Jay-Z was supporting Kasabian things. It was just crazy. Um, it really was an amazing time. What about you? If you went, you got all the memories of coming to Tea in the Park. What was your favourite year? Favourite memories? Let me know. Um, Although 2023 walking around Balado today is up there, I promise. So we caravan park up here. I didn't know that. We hid in caravan park. Like a holiday caravan park. What's it called? It is. Gallo Hill Caravan and Campeg Park. Right, with the pier, I found myself at the flyover, the motorway, take him into Kin Ross. So a lot of the campers at Tea in the Park would descend upon Kin Ross, which I guess would bring a lot of custom to local businesses. And I think this is maybe one of the routes people would have taken from the campsite to uh, the David Sand shops in Kinross or maybe anywhere where they could get supplies. And you can see Tea in the Park campsite just over there, right there, motorway here. I think I found a path back up to the services. Road in the park. What is this? This is the closest thing I've found to any, any tea in the park resemblance. That's a cool statue of the birds, the geese, but also creepy. Equally creepy is impressive. <laughs> There's a can of tenants. I've made it back to the Kinross services and I'm really thirsty, so I'm away to get robbed in there for a juice. It's always mad busy here. Right, that's me being robbed and refueled. Um, kind of feels like a mini airport in there. It's all exciting. Feel like you're going on your holidays. I'm just ending the episode almost. My car's parked over there. I've still not got the drone up and I'm still 50-50 if I'm going to do it or not. I guess if you're watching this, you'll know, but right now I don't know.
Right, that was a cracking wee drone flight. I only got a wee bit because I couldn't go too near to the airfield or the motorway, so I was kind of restricted. But I seen the golf ball, which was lovely, and I'm happy. And I'm happy with today and going round Balado. I'd have liked to get on the field, but you know, it's the way it goes. Um, and hopefully in the future, you know, Team the Park will return because I feel it was a big part of Scotland and we need good music festivals to bring all the people together through the joy of music. Anyway, I'm Ginger Man. I've had a great day here. Thanks for watching. Peace. Well, it was a lovely to see you. It's the end of the show. Bring on tomorrow. Where shall we go? Where shall we go? Say good night to the ginger man. One last ice cream for the bearded man. Pistachio.